Hey everybody, this is Steven, I could call myself a PC game, and we are back to Dung Rapa 2, Goodbye Despair. So, I know we just started the investigation, the reason why I had to be kind of that really that fast, because Ivan had to do other stuff to do in real life, so I want to bother us how to do exactly we did, like a little bit of some investigation we have to deal with. Like, there mostly something to do with um, the reserve department, uh, about the tragedy of Hospital Academy, not the, the tragedy, the one that you would think about. And uh, most likely, <laughs> I'm not sure. There's some other parts I might be caught interested about that, that name, the Izuru Kamukura. That's how you would say it. The one that call him the ultimate hope. The one who possesses like, all the talents around, I think. Anyone who has the, like, amazing talents and all. And mostly it has nothing to do, but like, um, there was like, not just only one ultimate despair, like Junko and Ashima, but there was like, more. So, I'm not sure how it's something that might be strange to you, I thought for sure it's only for like, Junko and Mukuro were on those two of the ultimate despair, because of what happened in the first game. But, there might be more. There might be still more story behind uh, what's been going on in the past, like, and I said it's kind of like a, a war, or terrorism, whatever you want to call it, but it might depend on how well it is exactly, or how the, the history of the past did take place then, but who knows, so yeah, but we'll see how well it goes. And <laughs> and also, I had to talk to Monokuma as well, there might be more information about the ultimate despair and all, but Fujiko then say something, um, like Jiko Inmoshi is already dead, but one thing, how did he know that Jinko is dead already? I mean, he didn't even like, I don't know, heard about the news or something? So I guess I have to talk to him. Hey, Fuihiko, is it true what you said? Jinko in the Shima is really dead? Yeah, how would you know, Fuihiko? It's, I mean, the six people know that they saw them there, Jinko is dead, and they all win. Huh? What? You didn't see? No, how about you know? Well, I did see it from like for the first game. So how about you know, before you go? There was a book called Manga of Moron Killing School Night in a bloody classroom. <laughs> oh, you read that book? <laughs> okay, that's kind of weird. No wonder why you. Oh, you know, but Jiko's already dead. A bloody classroom? No wait, what was that you said about the killing school line? Like the killings were. We were involved in. There were killings that happened at Hospital Academy. Yeah, that one of the files. As I recall, the mastermind took her all night because the remaining students worked together to defeat her. Well, yeah. Yeah, that's what it was. The killing school life ended up failing in the end. As a result, the six students who survived managed to escape from the Yan Academy. Yeah, I remember that. Hey! For a manga about the killing school life, it was drawn with a a lot of silly image and dumb gags. <laughs> really? That's kind of really that stupid. Get better at drawing. I don't even know what it is. According to that, the mastermind behind the fail killing school knife was Junko Enoshima. The mastermind took her own life, which means Junko Enoshima's death. Life. It turns out that killing school life was part of that whole biggest, most awful, whatever incident. <laughs> That call it a short to tragedy. Junko took away the memories of the former students of Hospital Academy and forced them to kill each other. Yep, went their memory from the school memories, and that's how they were like fighting against each other. Former students of Hospital Academy, she took away their memories. They're just like us. In a different way, that is. Apparently, the uh, whole thing was being filmed by surveillance cameras and broadcast worldwide. Is that the same thing to us as well? Like, they were broadcasting live in the island? If that was, then it'll be like almost exactly from the first game. It's like they recreate the whole thing to the past. There's a limit to be, being a cruel a hole. The Spain's camera were broadcasting the whole thing? So. The students of Lost Academy are widely known as symbols of hope. 
by forcing people to watch these symbols of hope kill each other for the sake of survival. They were trying to fill everyone who wants the Broncos with despair all at once. Th that mess up! Of course it does, that's what it is. If they're trying to make everything full of despair. I mean, that's how the theme for Dongarumpa is basically called despair. Huh. But that messed up plan was stopped. Junko Mishima failed. Junko lost the students she placed her in the trap, and after being overcome by the despair she created, <laughs> she took her own life, which means she deal with her punishment. Then, Junko is no more. I'm not sure she, if she will back or something like that. I mean, she's already dead for the first one, and I'm not sure she's gonna come back for the second. I mean, why ain't she staying in the Monokuma? I mean, if she. If Monokuma was there, does that mean Junko is still back again? I don't freaking know. <laughs> no matter how horrible she was, there's no reason to fear someone who's dead. Whether Monokuma's story is true or not, doesn't matter. <laughs> Junko Inazuma isn't alive anymore. Then. Who is our enemy? <laughs> Maybe just only just Monokuma then. Juko Inimashita is already dead. Are the rest of the Juko ultimate despair behind this? Are the files of Junko carried on her will? Are you saying there might be more ultimate despair then? But there was only two. Junko and Mukuro. Do you think there might be more around here? I don't know. It's the only thing I can think of. I mean, the killings were involved in reasonable resemble that skinny school life. <laughs> well, I don't know who the... Who the heck is imitating Juko and making us go through this, but... <laughs> an imitation is just that. An imitation. No shit. If the students from Hospital can be stopped the real deal, there's no way we'll lose to some fake. But if this really is an imitation, are those surveillance cameras the same too? <laughs> I'm not sure if the cameras are exactly the same. Yeah. The camera all over Java Walk Island. Are they broadcasting to somewhere? Just like the surveillance camera during the kids' school life? They probably do like same thing like before. I got leveled up to 55. I got to send a new one and updated one. Hey, Monica not saying anything. Man, Hajime, you totally know about that story, huh? What? Do you have a problem with that? Well. I really want you to read the manga version since I took the time to draw it. <laughs> sorry, sorry, but Fujiko did read it already. What are you gonna do? Oh well, I'll just raise the flag. Flag? What do you mean, raise the flag? What's going to happen if you do that? <laughs> you bet that there. It's the kind of like a death flag you were trying to raise. Ooh. What's up the time? Exciting. You're getting closer to clearing my character root. What character root? You're not making any sense again. Now. Nothing! I'll give you guys my all! I'll th tell you everything I know, including information on the outside and the inside. Yeah! I'll raise the flags like crazy! Why do I get a bad feeling about this? Well, I guess I can get lead then. Is it gonna teleport me? Of course, now in the fourth building. Huh? Yeah. How the heck did I just teleport? It's like, we didn't leave the classroom, now change a different floor. You know, we have fourth floor now. Am I just gonna, like, every way I go, the go keep down? And why is the black things again blurry? It changed to a different hallway again. So, son, what's going on to make something like this? No, I already decided that. And I'm not going to be surprised. That's right. There's no time for me to be surprised by something like this. You don't care about what. Going on here then? Oh, there's a Kanye one thing. But Kanye, have you not even like not this just starts going on? Looks like glitchy and there's a black bird. Kinda twitching her nose like a beast examining her surroundings. What are you a dog? Hey, what happened? Based on my gut feeling. Well, you know, just my gut, but I feel like someone's getting closer. Someone? What are you talking about? Huh? What do you mean, who? So... I don't know, it's just my gut after all. <laughs> it's just based on your guts then. It's just my gut! I'm not sure if the Minimaru or Kimi were kind of the same. 
but still, her gut is pretty impressive. For some reason, it's strangely intuitive. And Mona Koopa did say something about the main cast coming. What, do you think, like, Makoto's gonna be coming or something? Or Jungo? Whatever you wanna call it. It's surprising, but her gut must be correct again this time. But where to next? Well, one of the black, in, the black things are Kina Go. The yellow one means I had to go to, but can't proceed to. Oh, my pet! I forgot my pet! Uh, I forgot to take up. Oh! Doing like a coon along. And yeah, they think of the poop. That's kinda of really weird, but okay. Um Is there one room we can open? Oh, there's one. In the uh, music room! Oh, of course, the music room. Oh, thanks my good memory, so is there any in my information around the What is that? This looks like the music room. Yeah, what about that? It's not like a plant in some kind of digital. Hey, why is some of the walls are completely like, I don't know, pixelated? What the heck is going on here? It's like we're in a game world or something? I feel like I can see something strange. <laughs> is it a plant or something like the glitching one? Monument? Why there's a monument then? Looks like some sort of monument? Why would there be a monument in the music room? I don't know, maybe it's like kind of info then? Not just that, the mark engraved into the mon monument is the symbol of the Fuji Foundation, right? The uh, same thing. Below that symbol, there's a short passage engraved. To combat the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history, the graduates of Hospital Academy were among the many who established the Fuji Foundation. Huh? Wait, that's it? The Fuji Foundation was established by the graduates of Hospital Academy? Like, like someone who was, is it not Makoto and the others from the previous games? Maybe that might be more than, I don't even know. Uh, aren't they known as World Ender? This is completely different. Monokuma, he completely m made it up. Do you really believe that? I want to check the monument. So what's this? A uh, hologram? Why is there a hologram there? What is this? Where is it flying in the air? <laughs> That's kind of really strange. Why does it sound like a hologram there as well? It's like where it's like a, I don't know, a computer system? This, it's like a hologram, right? The flying letters are forming a sentence. Well, sadly, this is a Japanese one, so luckily it's English. It looks like it passes from the, passes from the email. Regarding the report we gave you the other day, we have the information a person who claims to be a survivor of the Hospital Academy. Survivor? Are you talking about Makoto in the in other five then? I mean, I feel like if anyone had, like, not much, but it must be the Makoto's and his friends. Upon further investigation, there are a total of 15 survivors. Yeah, it, it must be it. You may be wondering about the number of people at this time. If they survive, the survivors of the Hospital Academy, Possible maybe maybe targeted by ultimate despair. Targeted? What do you mean by targeted by ultimate despair? We believe we should acquire them and place them in our care as soon as possible. Though I don't believe the group can go that without far without far without Chikonishima rally them. In the worst case scenario, we must prevent a repeat of the skill in school life. Also, if there are survivors of Hospital Academy. Which expect them to be quite valuable to us. However, we are still investigating the details of their origins, and we hadn't located them either. We will continue investigating this matter. Also, regarding a separate matter, we received a report from the research facility on Jamwalk Island. Preparations have been completed. Oh, research facility on Jamwalk Island? Wait, it's not? So, I thought for sure it's multiple tropical island, but now we call it research facility? Okay, that's so it's the other way around. It was not the tropical island at all. Then, so um, what's that even reason behind all this Jabba Oak Island? Then, it seems we have we can proceed with the experimental phase of the Near World Program. Near World Program. Survivors of Hospital Academy. Fifteen students. Is that about us? Wait, man. Oh, I'm not sure about McCullough and the others. Than the previous one, but has me in the 
all of it. But it's only 16 students out there, isn't it? I mean, unless at 15 it was based on the ultimate talent. Like, including Hanjime, because he doesn't have an ultimate talent to begin with. It's including Jianki, who was part of Future Foundation. There were definitely 15 of us, but... Oh. Does that mean Jianki was part of Future Foundation? When did that happen? What does survivors mean? It's like they're talking from some other world. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let me... You'd be more likely of like what happened from the previous one, so... I thought for sure for the first game, but I guess not. What happened outside Jabwok Island? If the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history is really true, then the world isn't normal anymore. Maybe. I'm starting to feel like we might be better off not remembering the memories we lost. Nope. The Caribbean survivors. Okay, we got new two, but nothing. Look at the tunnel clue in this room. It's finally confirmed. The future foundation is on our side at least. That sounds like at least part. They were founded by the graduates of Host Peak Academy, and they took us in to protect us. Oh, is that so? But if that's true, Shanky should have made that clear to us. No, it's not Malakuma's restaurant. She probably couldn't say anything carelessly. But what, taking orders or something? Like. I told Jackie say, do not reveal your identity or anything about the future foundation at all. Whatever the way it comes up. Makuma, if he is the future foundation's enemy, then it's true that he must be the ultimate despair who caused the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. You think Junko wasn't in cause of all this? The ones who are carrying out the will of Junko and Nishima are making us go through this. Also, this caught my attention in the email too. What is this research facility on Jabaka Island? Mention the email. What's that about? <laughs> yeah, we, like everything, every series we've been through is nothing more than the Jabaka Island. But at the end, this whole thing is nothing more than a research facility. So it's not being like the true island then? It might be explained what happened on the chapter 0 when there was a conversation with Nakito that said like there's Jabaka Island. In that case, if they would remember that they already been in Double Up Island for them when they first seen it, then maybe they must be because of the memory they was like lost or something. The only future foundation facility we found was that ancient ruin. There's no way that's a visit facility. If there really is a visit facility on this island, there should have been other future foundation members here. Somehow there's still so many mysteries. <laughs> yeah, me too. So I guess that's all of it. I think the only thing we can go is the... Uh, I think the teacher's not so something. Okay, something's already gray, which means I can't go through, so... Yep, I was right. This is a teacher's notch. Yeah, I remember that part. What kind of information I get for this one? Um, oh, there's a hologram. <laughs> Even the plants are all a bit pixelated! <laughs> That's already weird. This feels different from this classroom. It's probably the office, right? I mean, the room kind of has the stuffy teacher vibe to it. The office, huh? Now that you mention it, it does look like that. Well, more importantly, have you seen Miss Sonia? I don't see her anywhere. I don't know either. I mean, last time I've seen her, she was a bit poor. How much longer is this guy gonna be obsessed with Sonia? Give it up already. Well, one thing on my mind, there's a hologram one. Like, same thing from the, uh, the music screen. It's a letter scrolling the air. Like the music from earlier. Looks like a passage from an email someone wrote. I think it's the same one from earlier. I guess I should read it. Okay. We understand this matter regarding the survivors. We be pretty sure the survivors were to hunt me and the others. In order to safely require them, please do your best and continue your investigation. However, you must exercise extreme cautious concerning the remnants of despair. And that's despair, huh? So it's kind of like a group organization when it became all the despair then? Even though they had lost Jinko in the Shima, the fact remains that they are incredibly dangerous. Even after her death, the tragedy has not ended. Perhaps they are still a leader on par with Jinko in the Shima. A leader? What do you mean? If Jinko in the is dead already, are you saying that maybe like, I don't know, being like secondary one? As long as we do nothing about the remnants of despair, we will not be able to end this incident. 
For this reason, the remnants of despair must be immediately eliminated once they are discovered. Eliminated? Okay, that's why not expecting. Everything is for the sake of shiny future. I immediately eliminated? Does that mean this is in order to kill them? But it doesn't make sense. If the survivors was more like the host speaking can be survivors, then why would it call survivors a, it's a red of despair? That doesn't sound peaceful at all. Well, I guess that's understandable. If the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history is as terrible as it sounds, it's pretty much all out war. If the remnant of despair are the ones waging their war, there's no way they'll be forgiven that easily. Hmm. I never expected her about them that despairs. The only I know for sure because there was two ultimate despairs was Junko and Mukuro. Interesting. Uh, oh, I know that picture. Uh, this must be, um, I've noticed about the picture in uh, the fan notes. It says something on the plant saying that Izuru Kamakura. Or is it something like that? So. It's a blackboard. Why is that blackboard? Hmm? There's something written on the blackboard. Uh, wait, what? Why do they have names of us? Why do we have our own names on here as, as well? Yeah, I know there's about the list of subjects and all. I mean, why do they have our names then? What's written here? List of subjects. It's written on the blackboard in large numbers. Just below that, yeah, it's every word. Except there's the one that has like Hyoko Sayonji. They one have like a they have a newspaper article on it. What is that? Our names I've seen before. But more importantly about the portrait. That's about it, right? It's shaped over when portraits hanging on the wall. I feel like I've seen it before. But then it into the pla pla placard says Close speaking can be founder. Izuru Kamakura? Yeah, that's it. That's the one. The, I seen it in the fan house. That same portrait, the same picture was found before. That he was a founder of Hospital Academy. The founder of Hospital Academy. And this name, Izuru Kamakura. Doesn't this clearly contradict the information I obtained earlier? Damn it, not a mystery. Who knows? It might be very important. But is it really that, really that guy who would do this? That's kind of weird appearance and all. Anyway, um. Let's have names and all, but why is only a newspaper article then? There seems to be a person on blackboard below that. Below that, Hyoko Sayonji is written here. Why Hyoko Sayonji on the below on the newspaper? Where is this newspaper? Wait, what? Why is this Miss Hyoko Sayonji in there? Wait, what? What is this? Uh, what? <laughs> is it? Don't tell me. Is this Hyoko? But she looked like adult, young adult. But when we, the first seen her, she was like a young, young little girl. No, is that really that her? It says Miss Hyoko Sayonji. This can't mean they say Hyoko, right? I mean Hyoko, we knew. Yeah, that. She was much smaller and looked more childlike. It's pretty much a divine feature. Yeah, but how? What's that even mean exactly? Are you saying the appearance are different? Or is it more like a twin sister? <laughs> I better not. I better not say it. But the photo in this newspaper, in the way I can see the resemblance of Hyoko, but her height and figure? It's too different from the Hyoko we knew. What does this mean? Huh? Hmm? This thing looks pretty new. Am I sure? Is she Yonko's older sister or something? <laughs> I was thinking that for sure, whether it's like a twin sister or, or something like that. No, it says Hyoko Sayonji here. Uh, oh, then Hyoko has an older sister with the same first and last name. Why would you think that? <laughs> Do you really think that either then have like a same name, or the first name, and the last name? Could they think that's what's this? An older sister with the same first and last name? I mean... That's the only explanation, right? I mean, look at it for yourself! That's not Hyoko! But, did you ever hear her mention an older sister? Yeah, I didn't even have a chance to hang out with her a lot. 
plus she didn't say anything about her family relatives. What does she have, like, a sister? What's not like that? Man. Well, it's not like I was that close to her or anything. Wrong! She doesn't even know the sister! Yuko is the Sayuji's family's only daughter! Only? So, so you mean this whole thing is actually Hyoko then? Hmm. If she doesn't have a sister, then a relative? No, there's still too much of a resemblance. What are you saying? It's Hyoko! Huh? Of course not! Wh what are you saying? Hyoko doesn't have a curved body like this! <laughs> really? Are you trying to make a, like, a jealous type to Hyoko? Because uh, she have like a famous body or something? I mean, she was famous for a childlike figure! She got away with all this kind of crap for looking like that! Well... I don't know what to tell you! Maybe she had a... growth spurt? Oh. Did she mean she'd been grown that high? I mean, she's not even like... Either when she was 18 years old or something? What are you saying? She's... Already dead! There's no way she could have had a growth spurt! If she does, then... I'm not sure when does it do, like, when gaining height. <laughs> well, regardless, all the clues I provide are true. If they weren't, it wouldn't be fair. What's going on? What the heck? This is the truth? This is truth. And Hyoko in this paper was actually the same then? Is he really saying this is the same person? That's impossible! I mean, how can there be a photo of a grown-up Hyoko when she's already dead? Why? What does she this even exist? Well, only way to find out until the end. Could it be related to that list of subjects over there? Huh? This is bad. If it says subjects, maybe it means there was some kind of experiment, right? Yeah, that might be the case, it's true. There was like 16 names on it. Did, did that experiment change Yoko's body? <laughs> or what am I saying? Just saying a lot makes it sound messed up! What experiment? If it's some kind of experiment, it would mean that there were also test subjects, right? I mean, our names are also written on the black one under that list of subjects. But what kind of experiment was it? Yeah, don't you know. What's going on? Eh, uh, what's going on? It's barely have anything to do with time travel. I have hope not. Man, you don't that fast, does it? <laughs> okay, with this, you totally raise all the flags on this floor. Okay, we're going down next then? <laughs> I mean, we're done with this floor? Yeah Congratulations, Dr. me. You shall now go on to the next stage. Next stage? I guess we're going for... For exit now, we're going to third floor then. So let me go back to third floor. Yep, I'll go on the third floor. But... Damn it, not again! Yep. And the walls are really like... All glitchy again. The hall is different from the last time. I guess when the flag on the convention is raised, I move to a different hallway than the last. But how can he do that? I don't know. Maybe it's just sound like mess up the like, um, transitioning effect of the going through in the room. No, that's not the time to be confused by that. Thinking about it, just going to waste my energy. Unless about the glitch effect to start happening again. Um, did we? Um, uh, yeah. There's. I was wondering, like, do we go be behind it? But no, it came from the stairs. So, anyways. Um, what two is that? The physics lab? I think a physics lab, right? Uh, you can't go to physics lab. I was hoping there's like any rooms that might be available. Oh my god, the the pillars. Okay, that's like heck, no textures and all, only lines. Full of lines. Um, I guess I can't go through here then. Maybe the classroom then. Oh my god, I think we're all tripping the cells. Why are there windows? Very quick! Oh jeez, that scares me. It's feels like I'm playing, going in a horror movie or something, or horror game. <laughs> uh, what the heck is this? P. Gimme? Oh, you can't be that weird. Maybe I'll give you something, a big treat then? Like, um. Maybe some chocolate? <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. 
I mean, why is it turning to a pig? <laughs> That's something weird. Very, very weird. Anyways. But, yeah, the windows are very, very weird and all. Oh, the back room. I guess it's the only way to go through then. Is there any information in here? Like a... Yeah, hologram. And there's a... Some kind of book over there. There's a blue... Blue... Blue table. A dartboard in a shelf lined with magazines. It's hard to think a room like this actually exists inside a school. <laughs> well, probably about this table. It's all floating, even the balls. <laughs> That's so very weird. But I'm gonna read the hologram now. Because the hologram itself might be very important. Like another one of those email addresses. This hologram again. What's this one said? It looks like another email and password passage. Regarding the report we gave you the other day, we have finally succeeded in acquiring them and have placed them in our care. I pretty sure talk about the, 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 the survivors then. Though they were all dispersed, we were successfully in acquiring of all 15 of them. Due to the fact that they, we were unable to ask them about specific details, it's unknown how they managed to survive the tragedy. It's been reported that some are wounded, so it seems certain that they survive under harsh conditions. Over the course of uh, detailed investigation, we determined that they are the same age as the others. So we decided to entrust them to the survivors of the killing school life. Oh, now that's the one. Survivors of the killing school life. There's gotta be Mako and... How much should I find that? I know it's Biakuya. Oh, I, gotta, I, gotta, I need to remember the name. It's a... Uh, um... There was Kyoko, Toko, and Hina, and Hiro. That's four. So that's six of them. So yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm trying to remember who it is. It made me feel like it's been one of like, no them, so... Yeah, there are like six, six of them. As for the remnant of despair, like the 15 of Boston, there are still no solid leads regarding this matter, and we have no new information to report. We will continue with the investigation. Once they are discovered, we shall eliminate them immediately. Really? Like, if they... Are you saying that if they finish up all the information they need about the end of despair, you decide to like eliminate it immediately? But why? To make sure, like, to end the tragedy? Everything is for the sake of future, filled with hope. And uh, update that. <laughs> Both uh, the survivors and them, they're in the despair. It says here that they succeed in acquiring them and have placed them in our care. That means we should have been protected by future foundation, right? No. Oh. Okay, I think for sure about the, the other one from the previous game, so maybe another way around it. Then why is this happening? If the Future Foundation was protecting us, why would they work? We were, were forced to kill each other on this island. Well, I guess it's not possible that the Future Foundation set things all up. What's this? My, my, Hachimi, if you keep waiting like that, you're gonna get a toothache and collapse. What's that supposed to mean? It's your fault. What is this hologram thing anyway? I mean, it's what you're doing, is it? Hey, um... you think what it looks like? There are the Future Foundation's emails. Oh, their emails? <laughs> okay, that's not really weird, but unexpected, but okay. I have to look through and read the information out of them. That's kinda weird. I thought they made a perfect clue! So I did a little bit of hacking here and there to get them! You do the hacking? What is, what is, what is wrong with you, Monokuma? You, you can't even do that? Whoever's controlling you seems to possess many talents. Someone calling the ultimate hacker around here? No, no! Well, who cares about me anyway? That's not important at all! There's no way that's not important. It's true, then they should connect in everything to what's happening right now. Yeah, but there's more. There's a... This is file. Why is it on the table? It's a file with Hospi Academy seal on it. It says, confidential. That means this is a big secret, right? What would an important document be here? Maybe this might be some kind of... Some hidden project or something? Why am I even asking a question like that? Obviously, Monokuma's responsible. Anyway, I need to confirm what's inside the file. About the... Hope Cultivation Plan. Hope Cultivation Plan? I never heard that before. For many years, Hope Speak Academy has conducted... Rigorous... Rigorous... Is rigorous? Research into various talents. Hope... 
the hope cultivation plant seek to use the fruits of our labor to further our true goal. With our hands, we will birth a true hope that will bring hope to the entire world. Truly, the program is the next invaluation in providing the ultimate education. This plant has been the Academy's wish since its foundation, so it must succeed at all costs. What followed was a series of detailed instructions in cryptic orders. It was full of difficult technical terms, and I had no idea what any of them meant. Yeah, what do you mean about the whole cultivation plan? What's that supposed to mean? Like, is it supposed to be bring, like, bread to a new hope? What do you want to call it? However, the word true hope left a strong impression on my mind for some reason. The hope cultivation plan was created for the sake of birthing true hope. Hope's Big Academy was behind something like that? <laughs> what the? What the heck? The Hope's Big Academy is hiding something. What gives? I don't really get it, but there's something about these words. True hope, huh? Maybe there's nothing. Might be something that we don't even know. I guess that's all of it then. I mean, there's nothing information we have so far, but okay. You're gonna move? Okay, yeah, you move. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Looks like a different hallway again. <laughs> I'm all upside down now. <laughs> oh god. And the news has changed as well. I'm pretty much used to it by now. But even so, get used to it? I mean, you didn't see now. The whole city and why they upside down and all? What is this, space? Am I dreaming or something? I mean, this is just totally disconnected from reality. <laughs> yeah, no kidding at all. I'm all upside down and everything. Like, what's going on? And why is there like numbers everywhere? Like, was it? Hey, Connie? Why are y'all go glitchy? Yep. It's close. It's very close. <laughs> okay, Akali, have you not even noticed but just seen the reading? Nothing? Read the bell? Someone is coming. Kind of her nose, examining her surroundings. I can't. I mean, do you notice everything? Based on my gut feeling, they're definitely real close. At least, that's what my gut is telling me. Then answer this. Answer this with your gut. Is it an enemy or an ally? Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. My gut feeling is. <laughs> they're both. Not helping, Mini Mario. Yo. It's fine. They're both. <laughs> I don't even know! You wouldn't agree because of what he's saying. Bold? What do you mean? You. I don't need details! It's just my gut after all! Well, that's true, I guess. <laughs> okay, I'll just ignore you when you're all glitchy. Um, can't go through here, so... Where am I going now? Um, I'm not sure where I'm going there exactly, so I'm tripping. <laughs> um, the library! I guess the only way to go through there? I mean, if it's a black, I mean, I can't go in there, so... Oh god, it... It must be a library. Yeah, even though the books are all lined white. I mean, have you not noticed about the scenery then? Monica probably left something here too. I should hurry up and find it. Well, no need because of the hologram. It's still a point. This hologram again. It must be another one of the future foundation's emails. I should read it. There's no doubt that it's, an, it's not a clue. To Future Foundation, 40 Division, Makoto Nayagi! Ah, uh, yes! This is it. <laughs> uh, of course, Makoto's gonna be back here again. But this is uh, this an email to Makoto Nayagi? Hmm. I'd like to know what the Future Foundation's up to. Of course, they're bringing in the news again, the, the new order, something like that. Where are you guys? What are you doing right now? What are you doing? It's a serious at the treason. Do you understand? Hmm. That's strange. But I didn't expect McCoy was part of the Future Foundation right now. But I mean, and until recently they all got out there alive. But now McCoy are working the Future Foundation then? Does it include the other survivors as well? Became the Future Foundation? Hmm. But what do you mean for like the serious type of treason? What did McCoy did then? Why are you protecting the event of despair? Oh. That's kinda interesting. It should be abundantly clear to you how dangerous it is to keep these people alive. Stay calm and think about this carefully. 
You guys have been lied to. I don't know what to do. Think carefully about what's important to bring the light of hope to the world. The six of you joined the Future Foundation because you agree with the late ideals, right? Yeah, six of you. Me refer to uh, Makoto, Kyoko, Toko, Yakuya, and Hina, and Hiro. I mean, if you think thinking, no, Yakuya, the one you see in 100 May, it was a fake one. As I keep saying before, the real Yakuya is still alive, and they work at the Future Foundation. <laughs> this will turn things around then. The Future Foundation rescued you from the tragedy you survived and cooperated with recovering your memories. Well, true of that. If we return the Remnant Despair to our headquarters, unless we eliminate them, the tragedy will never end. What did Makoto did exactly? What did the Future Foundation were thinking about him? Everything is for the sake of the future filled with hope. As I said, what does this mean? This email suggests that someone was trying to let the Remnant Despair escape? Why would you think that? This email is addressed to Makoto Naegi. But he's with the Future Foundation, right? Then why was he trying to protect the Fiat Remnant of Despair? I don't know. We didn't even end up. Mm. We, he, if he was here right now, at the very end, he would like to tell us the whole story then. Did he? Trade the future foundation? I don't know. He went to Makoto Night Game. I'm not sure if he betrayed the future foundation. Unless we don't see what happened in the end. Of course, not up there for a minute to spare again. Is that all of it? It's not that there's nothing new about you. Okay then. Are you gonna get glitchy? No. Still the same. Um, is there a new one? Might be open up. Anything? Up. Two B. Uh, classrooms open up. Okay. Different transition. Different transition effect, everyone. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> what? I'm in the laundry room. Huh? Didn't work in the classroom? Yes, but now I'm in the son of laundry room from first floor. I, I know where to get it, but. Um, this looks like the laundry room. There's no use worrying about it. But I was at school and now I'm suddenly in the laundry room. <laughs> of course it is. Um, there's a magazine that Junko. Oh. Ah, I saw you! I saw you peeking from the. the. what the vending machine? No! <laughs> yeah! You would definitely sure get a good with this. <laughs> there's a tablet PC. That's the only thing with a peer of it. This looks like a tablet computer. It looks like a power is on, too. <laughs> Who left the tablet in the first place? Is this the next clue? I pick up the tablet and immediately start to examine it. What it says? Top secret. Near World Program. The Near World... Near World Program? Okay, this guy tells us information about the Near World Program. Based on the hologram of the... The, e -hem, the email address or something like that. This word, near world. I seem to recall hearing it and seeing it a few times already. I'm just gonna tell us if it's about the near program. The near world program has another name. Psychotherapeutic communication simulation. <laughs> Called P PCI. A PCS. The near world program is built with the most recent psychotherapy technology and administrative software. Okay. To develop a near world program, individuals such as the ultimate programmer, the ultimate neurologist, and the ultimate therapist. I know one person about ultimate programmers, like Chihiro Fujisaki, for the first one, that the he was died, and just to kind of let you know, it was actually a guy, not a girl. If you didn't look at it, go check out the uh, first, uh, the Duncan Rabbit playlist, you can check through half of the very beginning what I did for the, I did the first game, so. Also, the ultimate neurologist and therapist, I don't even know anyone who have that one, unless it might be someone else's. We're among the many talented people whose research results were utilized, but mounted the device to a uh, cranium, the near world program. Allows its subjects to experience a synthetic virtual world. What, in going to a virtual reality world? 
<laughs> going VR style, buddy. <laughs> I'll just get a look through it. Additionally, the award program has another feature. It can replace memory formed in the real world with information contained in the synthetic virtual world. Replace memories? Is that the about school memories then? Therefore, it is possible to undo the trauma sustained in the real world through the use of the virtual world. However, this device is for a psychotherapeutic purpose only. Any other use is expressly forbidden. Though it is highly effective in treating brainwashing, abusing the device risks total personality destruction. Thus, extreme care must be exercised when operating this program. Oh my god, I think I lost this mind, even Hajime as well. Slowly, everything around me turned black. Synthetic virtual world? Program? I feel an emptiness, like everything is being tainted. <laughs> I think Hajime have like lost his mind, like, I don't know what happened anymore. A feel of weakness, like the world is collapsing beneath my feet. Everything is starting to feel meaningless. The desperate attempts, the sad goodbyes, the conflict, the trust I felt until now. It's all disappearing until all I feel is... Despair. <laughs> Does it? I screamed loudly, as if I was confirming the sound of my own voice. There's no way I can accept this. I... I'm starting to accept that. This... This... There's no way. Something as crazy as this actually exists. No telling. Do you really believe it's like an action, like a real one or something? I mean, look around here. Why is everything so glitchy? It's all digital. Like, what's that? Nice. You gotta raise the fire more in order to clear my character root. You gotta keep raising up to knock again, Monokuma. What are you then? <laughs> Nothing. The spirit is waiting for you. Impossible. This is it possible? It's all made up. Everything is all made up. Made up. Including me too? I'm not sure about you, Hunter. Got a new world program thing. Guess I ain't enough to. But it's gonna teleport it somewhere else. Yeah, that bears. Where am I teleporting to? Okay, straight to Monaco Theater with the uh, one of those Tai Chi theme music. <laughs> uh, what is up with your word, Monaco? I mean, I can barely hear it, so. Hey, how are you doing? Did you enjoy the killing school trip? By the way, do you guys remember the speech I made at the beginning? The speech from the very beginning. From this point on, I promise you a word that truly deserves to be called. Game. Really? <laughs> you guys are the only ones watching this who can save them. The end of this world is nigh. What you gonna do? What's gonna happen? <laughs> I mean, I barely even know the words clearly. But now it's all completely blue. It's exciting, isn't it? Heart dropping. Look forward to it. <laughs> Okay, the gun lost his mind, even different kind of color as well. Oh god! Okay, we're losing it. This hallway. <laughs> okay, now it's gone really. Okay, I'm losing my mind now. <laughs> now the hallway's gone really not crazy. I'm not sure what to do anymore. When we first arrived here, I walked down this hallway from the classroom to get to the gym. I don't really see a semblance, but. Oh god, oh god, I can't even barely see this much. Some of them gray mean I can't even go through it, so... What am I doing? Oh god, I'm losing. Uh, Sonya! <laughs> I can see through Sonya! <laughs> Sonya, I mean, I can see what's going on. Well? Are you familiar with the, the placebo effect? And the uh, nocebo effect? I know about placebo effect, but what nocebo effect? Huh? <laughs> the placebo effect is when your health improves after taking a fake medicine that you believe is real. And the placebo effect is ex exact opposite. Which means it's not the human brain controls all other brain bodily functions. <laughs> if the brain believes something is real, it will become real. <laughs> Everything is not real for this one, Sonya! Do you have to believe it, didn't you? 
Why would you bring that up all of a sudden? Huh? Huh? Oh my! Huh? Um... I I'm not sure! I... didn't fully understand! <laughs> you don't fully understand at all! I mean, you never seen everything, Sonya! What the heck? Okay, I'm just gonna ignore it all. And the door is still locked, so... Yep. Oh, come on, come on. Yeah, it's all glitchy. What do you want from me? <laughs> the moment you discovered the truth, was a lie. <laughs> Why is it glitchy then? All hope will disappear. <laughs> Fine. I guess this one's open. And it was, it was like locked, like from the very start of the chapter, right? Well, I guess would be a last secret then. Classroom Run B. Oh God. What the heck is that? It's like kind of like a one black box then. Get to go touch it in. Is this floating? <laughs> I'm losing my mind now. And plus, I see one behind it on the. It's like kind of cold there. But I'm not sure what that means, but I'm just gonna ignore it. That's impossible. There's no way something this big would be floating like this. <laughs> no kidding. But what in the world is it? In the moment I look at the object, the oh, it's spinning. What's happening? Um, do we turn it on or something? Chihiro, is that you, Chihiro? I oh, is Chihiro. It's gonna be alter ego, is it? I mean, I know Chihiro from the first game is dead at all. That it must be her alter ego then. I mean, she's still there. Does that mean she, the Ulti Eagle's still back again? <laughs> Welcome! Welcome to the Neo World Program! Of course. Are we saying we are in the game world then? So, basically, we're like some kind of virtual world? Is there a reason why is there a little glitchy then? A, a person? The floaty person is talking to me? Wh who is it? No. Is this even a person in the first place? Um, I'm not quite a person. I'm simply artificial intelligence program. <laughs> it's been a while I had to talk, do a voice with Chihiro for quite a while, so... It would make me happy if you call me Alter Ego. That's the name my master gave me when he created me. Yeah, of course, it was Alter Ego. I mean, I know Chihiro is already dead and all. So the only thing left is Alter Ego. So what happened about him by the time now? It, it can't talk! But what are you? Alter Eagle? Artificial Intelligence Program? I am the master broker behind the Neo World Program. I'm responsible for creating and overseeing this world. However, only Observer has the authority to directly influence you guys. Observer? I can't actually exert much influence. In fact, my existence is one that you don't normally meet. I saw like a apartment manager or something. <laughs> I noticed something. The 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 word is like did it type thing. The one who was talking. Yeah, that that's it. I may oversee the entire apartment buildings, but I like the power to manage individual rooms. But the virus has affected everything. I'm supposed to be imagining. Oh, uh, virus? That virus gonna be a monokuma, right? Be the why the the killing game starts happening? Because of that. This world I imagine is acting very particular. Hold on! My brain can follow what you're saying. Let me get on my front thought first. <laughs> Damn it, it's that feeling from earlier again. It's floating, floating like my feet are hovering about the floor. It's like I can't feel my feet or the ground. Like I can't even believe my own existence. Hey, you should know, right? Where is this place? Tell me. What is the New World Program? The New World Program has submitted the data collection and procedures for shaping the entire world. As such, only the data we collected during the experimental stage is being utilized. Specifically, that means the data detailing Jabberwock Island, where this research facility is located. That is why the previous Jabberwock Island cityscape was destroyed. Ergo, if I am in to, to answer your question, where is this place? The answer will be... Mostly Jabberwock Island. Certain portions for different depending on the circumstance. 
for Sackville? This school you're in? It appears the space entirely under the virus influence. Uh, okay. That virus referred to Monokuma, is it? That's probably why I'm appearing before you, too. However, even without the virus, the circumstances are a bit unnatural. You say the launch was rushed, and because of that, there wasn't enough time to collect many data. I'm so sorry. I don't really know the circumstances of the outside world. After all, I'm simply the overseer of the new world program. It's fine, Alter Eagle. I know you're gonna have a hard time for it. Most of his words. I understand what they meant, but I couldn't understand what was being said. There was no way for me to acknowledge this for truth. It would make much more sense if this was a fictional world. <laughs> I mean, this is a game, so that's one thing. Wait, are you saying this world is a fictional world? I feel... I feel I can't believe what's going on here. This missing sense of reality. All the mysteries, all the truths, they're all just fictions. <laughs> really? Until now? Is that... Even so, I need to know. I need to know what this world is. Hey, can you tell me? Hey, can you tell me? <laughs> Why can't you say that uh, on your mind and now you say it alone? What was the New World Program used for in the first place? The New World Program serves only one purpose. It is used to make the real world a splendid one. I guess you can say it's a program for creating hope. A program for creating hope. But the fact that we're here, and the fact that we don't have our memories, that's all the program's fault, right? Deleting memory is the first step toy replacing memory. Replacing memory data is one of the features of the Near World program. With the install memory control unit, it is possible to remove any time period you're set to. And from there, you upload the memories obtained in the virtual world. Removing memories of any type of period you set it to? Does that mean in the real world, our memories are still normal then? Someone Kuma was right. We did lose our school memories. If that's the case, then if we know about school memories at all, does that mean it does erase it? But why? Why us? Why are our school memories taken away? There's a reason for that, right? That is a mystery to me too. Putting the program on the survivors of Hospice Academy while it's still in the experimental stage. I'm sure there was a very good reason. Unfortunately, I don't know what's happening in the outside world. I'm sorry. Are you saying we're lab rats? <laughs> okay then. That's not that's the only thing I can think of. It sounds like we're just a lab rats. The future foundation did that to us? But they're trying to save the world, right? Or, is the Future Foundation not our ally? Um, I'm sorry, I can't provide that much help. If only I was more reliable. No, you don't have to say that, Alter Eagle. I know you're trying to be helpful and all. I would have lost my authority to a virus like this. All these new words make my head feel like it's about to burst. Can you tell me more about the Azera and that virus? Well... For this session, the New World Program was programmed to house 15 people. Uh, Sorry, this is stupid spam callers from different countries. I'm not sure why. It happens all the time, so back where I'm saying to. For this session, the New World Program was programmed to house 15 people along with two monitors. It's gotta be Jackie and Monami, right? Like, I mean, it's clearly in Jackie and being the members of the Future Foundation. Two monitors. Yeah, they were disguised as a teacher and one of the students. Yep, that might be it then. They are intent to guide the participant in this way. By the way, the observer in the teacher role has been given the authority to influence you all. But the observer in the student's role was not. They weren't given any special authority at all, so they seem the same as everyone else. What kind of authority does the teacher role have? As example, the teacher creates the rules of this world. And manage them. If the student teacher is properly managing the rules they created, there's no risk of abuse. But because of the virus affecting everything, that has changed. 
So the virus had to be Malakuma then, since he changed the rules and all. It changes world where violence shouldn't have existed in the first place. The new world program would have promised internal peace. But just like the outside world, it's become a world filled with violence and death. What is that virus? I don't really know the details behind its true identity, but the function is beyond my capabilities. No matter how much I try to stop it, it behaves as if it already knows what I'm tempted to do. In the end, it stole the portion of my abilities which contains my ability to build a world. It was like... It was a Grandmaster chess player. I didn't try to fight back so it wouldn't have complete control. But even so, a portion of the world has been modified at this convenience. She probably talking about the Manakuma Rock and the Fountain House. Based on what she's saying, it sounds like she's on the receiving end of that one side attack. But Alter Ego should be an impressive artificial tension that the future foundation created. I could tell ju that just by communicating with her. Which means, this supposed virus is so smart that it suppresses that this Alter Ego? If so, does a virus possess artificial intelligence just like her? You mean like a dark Alter Ego then? Damn, what the heck? Also, an artificial intelligence waging attack against another one. That's so freaking irritating. But how did the virus affect the new world program? The new world program exists in isolation. It's possible it was affected through a network. I'm fairly certain someone physically uploaded it. Physically? Like someone else uploaded it on his own? Like real person? Perhaps someone secretly brought an external memory drive containing the virus into the facility and directly uploaded it into the main computer where the near world program is installed. Based on my calculations, that's most likely what happened. It was brought to fit the addition facility? But the only person who couldn't enter that facility is someone who was a member of the Future Foundation. Damn it, what am I thinking? What? Why? Am I assuming that what I just heard is the truth? Why am I assuming that everything is a lie? I am got another police observer. And an update about the Near World program. Ah, oh, but it's true that the virus is powerful, and I'm completely overwhelmed by it. But I'm still able to defend the essential areas. So it has to so it has a limit too. A limit? If you took over the observer it has to follow the rules of observer. Um, such as, in order to end the program and release everyone, I need to follow the correct procedures and. Hey, come on now. Okay, really? Just here at the pier of nowhere, right when you interrupt something, when something very important. Where is it? Okay, even you're just a guard of the machine, that's enough hits from you. If you're gonna say something more. So bad that you exist between life and death, the death of yourself is inevitable. If so, I keep being parallel too. Oh. Okay, why just the back the up? Oh. Why appears to have changed it a little bit? The fluctuation based on the definition of existence that co constitutes a relationship. From there, the pi the parent diagram. Okay, then used to change. Uh then um, the sprites have changed a little bit. <laughs> Change realities by being caught up rapidly in a situation where your own existence is observable in. Uh oh. <laughs> now the twins. What's going on here? Accurate in course with the joint ownership of the world, and the situation when the context invites yours. I don't know. What's going on? <laughs> Monica, what did you do? Hey? Okay, now that they change it, the the UI everything, same dead. Ah, oh god, it's so creepy. Oh god, what's happening? I don't like this. What the heck? Okay, now it changes a little bit, and dungeon by the everything's all completely blank and all. Now it says Makoto. Is that Makoto? What just happened? Oh my god. <laughs> Is it really you, Makoto? You're right there, aren't you? Someone is right there, right? Huh? 
Who are you? Are you different from the other one? Maybe he can hear my voice from the side? I'm currently talking to the world through Alter Eagle. Oh, give me the message then? God damn it. Ever since you guys went into that space, the video's feedback has been pretty distorted. But even so, we were forced to watch you this entire time. Huh? Are you talking about uh, what happened at Jabba Walk Island? The thing you guys were forced to do? We were forced to watch it. We? You mean a future of Alicia Forced to watch us? I really want to save you right away. But because of the virus interference, I couldn't. Oh, you're trying to get in? But... Oh, okay. That's kind of really lost my mind now. Our orders are no longer being accepted. Including Shantan request. The new world book is beyond our control now. In that world, that person created an independent country that doesn't accept outside interference. But, Alter Ego create created an opportunity for me to speak to you directly. If this means that's not working, it means that the person I need to talk to is right here. I hope. <laughs> yeah, sure. It looks like this guy can't even hear me or see me. Just who is this guy anyway? You see? Our ally? Since there's no time, I'm going to say what I need to say. I believe you are there. Listen to me. But first, I should apologize to everyone. I know apologize it would help, but we didn't imagine something like this would happen. We didn't expect such atrocious virus was lurking inside the near world program. But the time is wrong. It's a responsibility for not realizing it until it was too late. But it's not just the virus either. I can't say for sure that the program didn't have any problems in the first place. To tell you the truth, I was unsure about whether or not to run the program on you guys. But this was the only way to save you all. I wanted to save you guys. Save us? What did he want to save us from? Why would this save us? You always seen a pass to enter the graduate exam ground, right? What password? Are you talking about the password from Zimmy Castle? 11037? That's yours, right? You know? 11037? Yeah, it was. That was your number then. 11037? That's the number we found in the Zimmy Castle. The door to interview was supposed to open after you fin after you all finished gathering the hope fragments. Well, finally it wasn't. Plus we had to proceed to chapter now, so that's one thing. From there, you guys were supposed to challenge the graduation exam. However, I prepared that password just in case something went wrong. Oh, so you have this, like, alternative option then. Like I said earlier, I had my doubts that this program was perfect. Even if the chance was slim, I thought the observer might end up going wrong. That's the reason I let the 11037 password in place where the teacher role would not be able to go. I never thought Nagito to sign first. Would East erase that password? <laughs> of course. Thanks a lot, Nakito. Anyway, I also the I also the person who said the password to that number. That number contains a secret. Someone close to me. Let that number to save me when I was a dilemma. <laughs> yeah, I understand how you feel, Makoto. From the the first case from the first game. Can you understand what I'm trying to say? I'm trusting that will to you all. I have to trust it to your future. But that person trying to abuse the graduate exam. I'm sure they are going to crush you with despair. It's the graduate exam that's waiting for you. But I want you guys to endure it without giving up on hope. I want you guys to withstand it until I get there. Because I have a secret to defeat them. Does that mean he has a secret plan to defeat Malakuma? I don't know. What he's gonna do? In the worst case scenario where an observer who has the role of a teacher has got God's role, I prepare a hidden command to use at the graduate exam site. It's the four shutdown sequence. Oh, the four shutdown sequence? Are you saying like it will shut down the whole system then? Four shutdown sequence? Even the teachers already can't stop the command. It's a way to end this that you guys can choose on your own. Independently of the observer. Which means, even if they stole the teacher's authority, they shouldn't be able to stop it. If 
to use that, guys will win. Can we? I got a mad feeling about that one. However, in order to start the four shutdown sequence, you need more than half a number of people. In order to do that, I don't know. Don't go away, Makoto! Don't go away! I need to somehow get that number. No! Makoto! You only need a chance to come forward, is it? Oh, uh, great. <laughs> um, this isn't good. No! Makoto! Dang it, he just gone out. Maybe it must be exit out, isn't And back to here. Keep saying that, that, that much. Hmm? Say what? What was that just now? Nothing. Hmm? Hey, Hajime! What was that weirdness just now? You don't feel it? N nothing, really. Hmm. I see. Keep it a secret. Anyway. Oh, well. Anyway, that's all the kids you're gonna get. What hint? If that no good uh, professional tangent tells you any more useless stuff, <laughs> I'm gonna buy again! Sure, whatever. Did Monaco not notice what just happened? Maybe he wasn't paying attention. It's been a while since I've spoken on Link, but it's important to talk to you. It was worth waiting a long time here. Hey, about that guy just now. There shouldn't be anything else for you to ask. See, it'd be bad if Monokuma would hear us. That means Monokuma doesn't know about the conversation I had with that guy just now. You guys have a weapon. A very powerful weapon. It all depends on how you guys use that weapon. The only thing I can do is prevent the virus invasions with all my might, so you guys can use that weapon. The rest is up to you all. Do your best. Do our best, huh? But what do we have to do? Our best at. Mr. is getting solved. I'm finally starting to get to see the truth. But what are we supposed to do when the truth is really a lie? We know we're working towards the conclusion that nobody wants to hear. But still, do we really need to work hard and do our best? Is there really a reason to do our best? If everything was a lie, then isn't everything just meaningless? It's the same for killings too. Even though we had to experience something as painful as that, something as tragic as that, wouldn't all that be meaningless too? When the world is flipped over and becomes so irrational, what am I supposed to do? Well, you don't even know for sure about the what is the shutdown sequence you must do, so. Anyways, I'm pretty sure that's all we can take so far, so. Uh, before we begin, I need to check my pet. Yeah, I mean, Marvin, why I'm wondering if we like, check the pet this much? I mean, just before something bad is gonna happen, or only have a chance to talk to uh, uh, my little pet here. Maybe play with this thing? I'm not sure how much I get hope maybe I get so far, so. Yeah. I guess that's pretty much it then. Is that all we're gonna have? Yep, I guess this is it. That's all we're having, right? Um, so, uh, I'm getting tired of waiting. Shall we just plunge right in? <laughs> okay, you starting to get bored already? It's time for the long awaited graduation exam! Okay, da <laughs> I can't stand without all the glitching. Please enter the red door located on the first floor of Hope Speak Academy. That means this one's a lock. <laughs> See you soon. I notice your drinks are back the way it's supposed to be. <laughs> Usually you have like a tropical drink. Now they got like a like the wine thing again. A red door, huh? It's just a waste of time thinking about what this all means right now. For now, I need to d finish this. I need to just focus on that. Yeah, we are in this door. Now we're going to lead to um, the class trial, right? He means there's red door, right? Do I just have to go to in here? If I do that, will this be finished? Okay. Different transition. Oh god. I can't go up and down by not moving away, so. I guess I'm moving in. Oh god, I'm tripping! 
I'm really trapping myself. And I can't turn around and everything. Just look straight towards the lights. Oh, God. Ah, it's so bright! Ah! Class on ground one. Uh. Huh? This place! You're back to where it came from, right? The one thing about the uh, when we go to your ruins? This must be it, right? Yo! Looks like everyone's here! Yeah, back where we came from, but didn't even mention what's going on with all those uh, weird particles and glitches and digitally or something like that. Damn right! He sees that. This is going to be the final place. However... However... This place is... Yeah. Is this a trial field? But why is a trial field? It sure looks like a trial ground, but... The vibe is way different than the one from before. Um... We've been here before, right? Yes, we do. Yeah. This should be the place that the door at the ancient room leads to. Hey! Huh. It seems pretty strange that we've been in the other buildings up till now. Damn it. It's like we're dreaming or something. If this is dream, if this too is very... Welcome! So you finally arrived! Congratulations! You guys are the first ones to ever beat this game! <laughs> After stopping by Hope Speak Academy, you finally come back to this place. <laughs> to the graduate exam site within the ancient ruins of Jabberwock Island. You. You can give a fancy name like graduate exam site, but it's no different than the trial ground from before. <laughs> from before. <laughs> this trial field actually inspired the one from before. So in a way, this place is original. Hey, hey. Who cares? This scratch exam means we can finally go home, right? Of course! Of course! If that's what you guys decided! <laughs> yeah, that's one thing for sure. What if we want to stay in this island forever? Huh? And if we have to decide, what do we have to do? Now then! Ahem! Please take a look at the SED touch panel built into your seat. Compared to the other trials, the rules are much simpler than this time. Okay, this says graduate and repeat. I wasn't even like this before. Yes, indeed! There are two options. Graduate and repeat, right? You just have to choose one of them and press it. Or you will cast your vote, and whoever won has the majority will be considered your final decision. If you don't press either of them, you'll be treated as an absence and will not be counted. In other words... Which means, everyone who has died up till now will have their vote treated as absence. So basically, like, they can't graduate then? Then... Then, the result is based on a majority vote. Hmm. Ahem! If graduate is chosen by majority vote, from there, in the think that you're gonna... Kinda like a graduate ceremony called the graduation program will begin. Uh, even if we do this stupid majority vote, the result is already pretty damn obvious. Come on, let's move this along. We can press it now, right? No, no, no! No, no, no! You can't do that yet! Mm. I mean, your result hasn't firm yet, right? You will to be swept away by society harsh current? Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Who the heck cares? I'm gonna press it! What's this? My, my! Which of your all races are you using to spoo bio? To participate in the graduating program, you need my final stand as your teacher, you know? What? Does that mean it won't end with just a majority vote? <laughs> so we have to wait for uh, your decision then. That's right! After the vote, I'm going to judge every single one of you to see if it's okay for you to graduate or not. Damn it! So even if we vote, you're saying we won't graduate unless you acknowledge it. Wow. Um, I'm very sorry for being rude earlier. No way! But you don't have to wait! There's no way I won't acknowledge your graduation. This is merely a formality. I'm just doing it because that's how it has to be. He's doing it because it's how it has to be? It doesn't mean he can extract his will over everything. He too has a limit. Is this what Alter Eagle was talking about? Anyway! Anyway, if you don't want to do it, you guys still need to do it to solve the mystery. Afterward, you cast your majority votes, 
and from there we move on to the graduation program. <laughs> but why do we even have to go through something dumb dumb? Hmm. Well that is You said you're waiting for the main cast, right? Yeah. And I'll show you whether Makoto or Junko. Hmm? Hmm? Which means you're just stalling for time then. <laughs> Who's the main cast? Hmm. Oh, no need to worry about that. It has nothing to do with you guys. That is... There's no way it has nothing to do with us. We're the only ones who are involved, you know. So annoying. It doesn't matter if you're involved or not. You're just a bunch of chums in the big picture. That's why it has nothing to do with you. Just perform your roles without complaining. You piss me off. Hold on. What? What a chump comment. I can't ignore that. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's not. It's a point no idea, but. Make sure you turn off your toy! I won't forgive you! How dare you treat him like a toy! What's this? I did treat him like a toy! You got a problem with that? <laughs> yeah, right. I created everything! <laughs> Pika -ka! You're actually speaking a fight with me? I'm basically a god! Just how promising can you guys be? I guess this is just the nature of life. <laughs> Find it! Before you die, seal my power into your memories! What's it to you? Power. Wait, what? What's happening? Oh, is it state then? Okay. So we'll just get straight to it then. Uh, yep, ignore class trial. Why is everything going to shape? I'm just gonna that. But anyways, I think that's what we're gonna have, but we're so getting close. We're getting close to the end, guys. I'm not sure how well I can take it exactly if I'm willing to finish it before at the end of this year. But I I also have something important to tell you. I got big plans to have in tomorrow, so you know about something, so please look forward to see it. So I also know something and all the things that are completely glitchy and some of the words are really different from before, so I'm just gonna that. But anyway, I'll come back. By any means necessary, I get able to finish this before at the end of this year. Uh, maybe, maybe if we able to finish this, and probably we'll do another one for next year. All for the best. So, anyway, that's pretty much it for Dongo Apple 2 Goodbye Despair. If you like this video, hit that like button too. Light them up! And want to see videos or check out, you have to go subscribe. Until then, I'll see you guys next time.